Good morning, church family. Welcome to this week's edition of BHC Praise as we gather together today to pray for our church family. I'm reminded of a sermon I'm working on, uh, presently working on for the weekend. It's found in Matthew chapter 8, verses 1 through 4. I want to read those four verses before we begin. It says, when, he, when Jesus came down from the mountain, great crowds followed him. And behold, a leper came to him and knelt before him, saying, Lord, if you will, you can make me clean. And Jesus stretched out his hand and touched him and saying, I will be clean. And immediately his leprosy was cleansed. You know, what an exciting story that a man had faith to say, Lord, if you're willing, you can make me clean. If you, this man who had leprosy, a dreadful, dreadful disease, truly believed that Jesus was able to heal him. Regardless of how bad his condition was, he had the faith to believe that Jesus could do anything. When you pray, do you believe that God can truly answer your prayers? Do you believe that God can heal your sickness? Do you believe that God can open a door? Do you believe that God is sovereign and in control? It's called praying in faith. We're not trying to manipulate God to do what we want to do rather than what God wants to do. But we need to pray with such an attitude that we pray in faith, truly believing that God is God and God is able. So as we pray for these prayer requests today, these people who are seeking a touch from God, pray in faith, saying, Lord, if you are willing, you can make me clean. Join me now as we pray.
for joining us for BHC Praise. And as we conclude our prayer time today, I want to encourage you to, to, to read this scripture that, that I focused on today. It's the sermon, uh, topic of my sermon this weekend at Bellevue Heights. It's just a reminder of how we need to come to our Lord in faith, believing that he is who he says he is, believing that he can do whatever he wants to do, believing that he is the sovereign, almighty, all-knowing, all-powerful God. And he desires to heal you. He desires to make you well. If you will come to him believing that, you can be touched. You can be touched by God. Have a great day.